good day, good afternoon, and good evening. Today we are jumping right into the apartment. The events depicted in this game and its creation took place on the lands of, I don't want to mispronounce that, people of the Kulin Nation. We pay respects to their elders. Gosh, the scenes always move so fast. Hopefully you guys are able to catch it. Oh, oh gosh, okay. Months ago, when all this started, I moved back in with my family. We've been living in isolation since March. I left my city apartment and most of my belongings behind. When I was preparing to leave, I had an eerie feeling I would be gone for a long time. I'd live here for less than three months. It was a big decision and privilege to move into a place by myself. During this time when everyone is facing their own challenges, I haven't allowed myself to think about my apartment. Oh, what does it matter compared to everything else? How will it feel to return for the first time? Oh, wow. Pack of disposable gloves. Ugh. Pack of disposable masks. Perfume. I didn't take this with me. Wore it every day for over 15 years. Haven't worn it since. Goblin statue. A childhood birthday gift. Old mirror. Is this all the stuff I just got rid of? Wooden box of jewelry. Rings. Voodoo toy. A gift. My favorite Pokemon. Suitcase half-packed. I had been preparing for a trip overseas. That didn't happen. Earrings. So what happened to everything we didn't take? Well, cabinet. From an old video game installation. Before I left, I was asked to show this in a multiplayer exhibition. It never happened and probably never will. Oh, man. Keys. This is heartbreaking. Sometimes I wake up there thinking I'm here. Oh. Bought for my trip overseas, never worn. Fan. It gets hot in here. Will they be musty, moldy, moth-eaten? Oh my gosh. Oh, this is... Oh. We, we just cleared out our entire room. Too wobbly to stand upright. Washing machine. Are we just making everything vanish? A birthday gift. I really feel like we're just making... Luckily, my family had some. The supermarket shelves were empty. All the young women in my family get perfume for Christmas. Face serums. Apply soap and water, rub palms together with fingers flat, rub palms together with fingers interlocked, rub one hand on top of the other with fingers interlocked and swap, wrap hand around other thumb and twist, swap. Gosh, do you remember that when they gave us all pretty much papers on how to wash our hands? The first stranger I spoke to in seven months was a police officer at a roadblock. After slowly inspecting my driver's license, she declared, that's not you. I'm glad we took our toiletry bags. An unusual Christmas gift that became very handy. I didn't take this with me. It'll be dead by now. Oh, I hate it. I don't remember what this is called. I took it with me. Too many bones for a bath. Oh my gosh. We just left. 
postcard apple blossom. The previous tenant had a big painting of a small hand hanging here. Artwork field at dusk reminds me of home. Homemade knitted blanket, a birthday gift. Fortunately, it fit through the doorway. Laptop bag. Last used for an upsetting video call with friends. They didn't understand at the time. One even said my situation sounded cool. God, it was such a god-awful couple of years, wasn't it? We're all still trying to pick up the pieces of these. The first thing I placed when I moved in. An extravagant op shop purchase, difficult to carry up three flights of stairs. Last used to play Return of the Oprah Din. This was dead before I left. I, I wish we could have taken all of our things. What is that? A switch. Video games, man. Oh. Video games got us all through it. Allegro's fish tank. I would hope so. It won't be the same returning without my little fish friend. Oh. The apartment gets direct sun. Need to keep an eye on the temperature. Oh, birthday gift. Didn't get a chance to hang this up. Box of aquarium supplies. Oh. Sometimes I worry that the door wasn't closed properly. I'm not sure you can freeze these. <laughs> Only one left. Microwaved lasagna. There's always one of these in here. I hope I didn't leave any fresh food in here. Cans of beer, cans of Pepsi, good soda choice. Oyster sauce, sweet chili sauce, butter, sliced cheese, mayonnaise, homemade sauce, sliced ham, homemade jam, delatable reeds, jam made with blackberries picked with dad. Almond milk. Another milk was... Co All other milk was completely sold out. Water jug. Oh, gosh. What? Oh. Mixing bowl. I read that in France. A woman returned to her apartment after three months to find potatoes have overrun her kitchen. I hope I didn't leave anything in here. Sandwich press. We got a toaster and a microwave. A kettle. Why is there a mirror here? <laughs> I it used to leak, but a tradie fixed it by putting silicone everywhere. Oh man. Everything we took with us, it'll be dead by now. Instant coffee, black tea, and green tea. These tins were an old housewarming present. Teapot. Spreads. The breakfast of champions. Cereal, tin of tomatoes, flour, pasta, one of the last packets at the supermarket, spices, olive oil, oh this breaks my heart. <clears throat> 
Man, she's so excited to have her home. And just watching everything just move away. Only used once or twice to check that it works. Gosh. Ugh. Cookbooks. I love cookbooks. I have so many of them. And art supplies. Ugh. Oh my gosh. It's all so empty. It doesn't work very well. I need to tell my real estate agent. My gosh, is there anything I've missed thus far? I don't think so. It's nice to look out at the tree while doing the dishes. Mm. I didn't even notice these little guys. Little things. A collection of gifts and mementos. Oh, during the bush fires, the windows had to be kept closed against the smoke. No matter the time, I could always hear the traffic passing by. I wonder if it's quiet now. Oh gosh. In the afternoons, the sun comes in and plays across the walls. When it rains, it's nice to watch the water run down the glass. Oh, I believe you wholeheartedly. Oh, man. Oh. It gets so hot in this room that it has two... Windows. There's a dangerous crack through this window. It'll be fixed before I return. Oh. Can't open this too wide or you can see in from outside. I hate that she had to move from her home. Oh. Oh my gosh, there will come a time when I move out of this apartment and never return. Just like the tenants before, and the ones before that. Oh man, after I move out, someone else will move in. After they move out, someone else will move in. Oh my gosh. At the inspection, I didn't notice that the tiles are the same as my family's home. Is that why it was so quick to feel like home? The carpet is grooves and bumps from the previous tenant's belongings. My bed aligns perfectly with theirs. Oh... What will it be like when I return to my apartment? It's hard to imagine it's still there, the same as I left it. During this time when everyone is facing their own challenges, it's hard to imagine that unlike everything else, it will have stayed the same. This is so precious. That was so cute. That was such a reminder of how covid really was and it was so crazy i hated it so much if you guys enjoyed this and you wanted to check out the game the link will be down in the description if you enjoyed this video please be sure to give it a thumbs up also subscribe and hit the bell notification so that way you're notified whenever i upload a video and thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I hope you all have a beautiful day, a beautiful afternoon, and a wonderful evening, and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Bye!